Welcome to SC Custom Designs, where we are almost done with the little doggy lift. Uh, if you might recall, episode one was Angela, who uh, said, can you make me a little stand for the dog? And she gave me all this material. And so we sliced it and diced it and came up with what you see here. So we're just about to deliver it. Let's go ahead and uh, screw, screw this in here. What? Whoa, Angela. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm just what a coincidence. How are you? Hi, honey. I'm good. Okay. Cool. Hello. I am actually videoing. Uh, let me just screw this guy in. So these are deck screws. They're self... Uh, not that you wanted to know this, but these are self-sealing self and, and, and they just screw and they're wonderful. This is my go-to. So here's your unit. It's um, amazing. It's just what I needed. Cool. Just what the dog needed. And it's, um, we have it at 12 inches. I believe you said between 12, 11, 11 and 12 inches, and we have 12. Perfect. That's how, that's how we worked it out. So, and, and here's your leftover. Look at that. We <laughs> utilized all of the wood, except for that. So, cool. This is so great because, you know, the old dog, he doesn't have good joints anymore. Yeah. Um, and my SUV, as you know, is a pie. Yeah. And it's How do you even get in it? How does that work? Do you need this? Are you making a short joke? And she's my customer. Anyway, um, it's either this or get another car. And I'm not getting another car. Yeah. <laughs> because of my dog. Yeah. So, but I love my dog. And Wait a minute. Who is this? Oh, hello. The official name is Frederick, oh, hello, Frederick, and sometimes Fred, hello. I call him Git, comes into the wood shop to see what's going on. So we have two visitors today. We have Git. <laughs> He's been in a few of our videos in Dexter. So I'm sorry. Go ahead, Angela. Nothing. This is perfect. This cool. is just what I wanted. He needed a awesome. stepping, a, a step up platform that's halfway between the ground and the back of the SUV. Okay. Because he just can't jump into the SUV anymore. You know, he's he's got some hip issues. Yeah. So this is halfway. All right. Awesome. It's perfect. I know he can negotiate it. He got rid of all the wood in my basement. <laughs> That's I'm cool. Thankful for. This is amazing. Cool. I'm gonna cover it with a tarp. So it's uh gonna be, you know, it won't get you know, be somewhat waterproof. Yeah. And then I'm going to put rose petals. Rose petals. This is awesome. And uh, I'm going to come every morning and say good morning. And so Rocco's going to love this. Rocco is going <laughs> to really be grateful to you. Awesome. Hey, yeah. thank you for stopping by. Oh, we'll yeah, have sure. this over in about 10 minutes, yeah. if okay. that's okay. I'll be back. Thanks. All right. Dave. You're welcome, Angela. Hey, thanks for coming into the shop. Um, this is pretty cool. We've had a busy day. We've had uh, a guy from Dover Plains come up. He was over there working on the the, uh, the Delta over there, the drill press, and doing some things. And uh, we're doing a reorg into the shop here. Um, we, we're moving some product that we've made under the bench. As you can look in the past, uh, the, uh, when I made this unit, this is this is uh, eight. What is it? Sixteen feet long, and it's made out of four by fours. The whole house could fall on this, and it wouldn't go anywhere. So I like all the space, but I got to uh, continue doing the reorg. As you know, we're in the middle of a bandsaw box frenzy. We've just uh, got so many orders coming in for these bandsaw boxes. So I digress. Let's get this guy done and get it over to the customer's uh, place. And uh, once again, if you like what you're seeing, subscribe to our channel, SC Custom Designs, and hit that bell. And uh, anytime you hit that bell, you'll know right away uh, that a video went up for you guys to view. Thanks again, and uh, God bless.